I was watching a biography of Dolly Parton, and I was thinking about you and I and people, of how things change in our life, that we come to places that we've just gradually been going uphill, 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 and then it plateaus, or maybe even just takes a dive. Uh, you know, the country music stars went through that in their lifetime. They were the main music of America. And then all of a sudden, there was all this other music. And the music industry changed from the bluegrass and from the telling of the ballads, um, the stories uh, that were handed down. And music totally um, spun off into new places. And Dolly reinvented herself. Uh, she uh, went into movies. At one time, she um, uh, began investing in um, her hometown. Later bought uh, places for families to go for entertainment. Continually reinventing herself in order to stay in business. I heard her speak about that. And she said, when things would change and it would really look like she wasn't going to sell any more music or be on the charts like she used to be, that she just said to herself, this is what I've always felt like I was called to do. This is what I feel like the Lord put me here to do. So if I have to sell my music out of the trunk of my car, I guess I'll still sing and write songs and sell my music. Now, you and I, we have to have that kind of determination in our, in our personal lives to be able to make it in our marriages, with our families and our children in troubled times, on our jobs when things are difficult and changing, when life really makes a, a, a turn and kind of leaves us at the intersection. But with Christ, we must make up our mind. That no matter what happens, I'm going with Jesus. I think about John the Baptist. No matter what happens, I'm going with Jesus. James the Apostle. No matter what happens, I'm going with Jesus. The three Hebrew children. Daniel. Mary, the mother of Jesus. Everything's changed. It looks like I'm going to be the mother of Jesus. But that's what I'll do. The determination to be who you were put here to be in Christ and in his kingdom. I pray you persevere in being you through Christ.